I don't need a partner. I don't need, I don't need a friend. I need my older brother. The stars aligned for that night. Everything was perfect for that night. The story was told, the emotions were high. You had people all over the world standing and cheering and crying and all kinds of emotions. Beloved by wrestling fans around the world, Dustin Rhodes has nothing left to prove. And even at 50 years old, he's showing AEW's young and promising talent what it means to be a living legend. Stakes are high and I'm excited to show the world what this 50-year-old man who has survived five decades can still go out there and do. In May of 2019, Dustin Rhodes was walking into Double or Nothing in his match with Cody as if it was his last ride. But since then, he's had something of a resurrection. He's so much different now. He's got an energy that is infectious. He's a different Dustin. He's just different, and he's a better Dustin. I have probably counted out Dustin more times than I care to discuss. And every time I do, it comes back and he proves me wrong. His match with Cody last year was as good a wrestling match as I called in decades. This Saturday, he faces what may be his toughest challenge yet, as rising MMA star Jake Hager has much to prove. Stepping into the ring officially, for the first time in AEW. Jake Hager was a three-time All-American wrestler at Oakland University, Division I school. He also played football for the Sooners for a good while as a defensive tackle. So he was a two-sport star. Jake Hager and I have known each other a long time. I've never liked Jake Hager, ever. What is, oh, wait a minute. For the love of God, is that? It's, it's Jake Hager. Jake Hager. He is a phenomenal athlete. I mean, he is, he's got so much natural ability and natural drive and perseverance. Jake Hagar is the most feared MMA fighter on the planet today. And guess what? He's undefeated and that's a shoot. To be able to be successful in Bellator and MMA like he has been, you gotta be pretty damn tough. You gotta be beyond tough. And it's all over, Jake! Submission. Jake Hager's an animal, undefeated in MMA fighting. He's got another fight coming up. So Dustin, I think, as good as he is, uh, has never faced someone like Jake Hager before, because Hager's got something to prove as well. And there you go. He's the real deal. And so I think being in MMA has just helped him expand his arsenal. So now he can beat you wrestling, or he can beat you in submissions. He can beat you striking. That makes him the toughest man in AEW. And that makes him the toughest man in the entire professional wrestling business, baby! I think he'll put up a great effort to make sure that his first match in the AEW is a win. He's going to be a very, very tough out for Dustin. After Hager left him with a broken arm last October in a brutal attack, it's clear that Rhodes aims to even the score. Jericho ordered Hager to break Dustin's arm. He did that. He smashed his arm inside a limousine. MMA was oh, oh, my oh, God! Oh. It just did it to car! The cars did it with Dustin's headprint! His arm! His arm! No, no! no. Oh, God almighty! What the hell else? Dustin has endured all of it, and it's it's been eating him up. He was in that cast for months, and now this is Dustin's chance for revenge, but that's a tall order, no pun intended. Hager is as tough as they come. You act like an assassin, but you're just an errand boy. You're Chris Jericho's little <laughs> That's what you are. You know, Dustin is not just smart as far as the mind games and the head games of what it's like going into a big match. Dustin's a genius. Okay, so for him to call Jake Hager Jericho's I really don't think Dustin believes that. Just my opinion. I think Dustin is trying to rent some space in Hager's head. Hager has been, I hate to say this, more of a follower than a leader. You don't hear him talk. You always see him stand behind or stand beside him. Chris Jericho as his muscle. It'll be interesting to see, you know, how he performs in this match. Dustin's had matches here. Dustin's had a classic match with his brother Cody last year. Hager hasn't. This is his debut. You think he's not going to come out all guns blazing? I will leave nothing behind me. I will give it all to you.
everything that I am and stand for. And my anger will be taken out on Jake Hager. The natural Dustin Rhodes is back. When you're as credible as a Jake Hager, I, I, I don't think him not having a big match in quite some time is a problem at all. I, he's still a bad son of a gun and, and people terrified him. I was there when Dustin was, was named The Natural. That name was really put upon him by his father, Dusty, because Dusty knew and we all knew that he had this natural knack and natural ability in the ring, which he still has. You can knock me down a thousand times and I will get up each and every time and look you square in your eye and fight you to the bitter end. This Saturday, will Jake Hager prove to the world he is one of the most dominant forces in any ring? Or will Dustin Rhodes continue his amazing journey that has spanned five decades?